Members of the civil society in Lagos protested the gruesome murder of Deborah Emanuel and other wanton killings in the country. Senior correspondent Ivy Kano reports. The venue of the protest is the realm of glory ground at Okota. The placards had inscriptions expressing their anger one after the other, those present say enough is enough according to them no country can survive with the level of bloodletting being experienced in nigeria those who kill deborah are those who have enabled this evil system where laws do not rule and impunity governs a country the battle is now ours the shame is ours if we are if we succumb to the violence and intimidation they have unleashed food they don't weapon weaponized food, poverty, hunger. Because you know when hunger they catch you, you know they think straight at all. People who commit premeditated murder call it blasphemy. They call it blasphemy. So how? Pastor of Realm of Glory states why the protest became necessary. It's to wake up our conscience that have entered into coma. People are dying in their hundreds every night every day it's not just deborah the question is if it's my daughter if it's your daughter is this how we're going to be keeping quiet deborah was murdered by bloodthirsty people in the name of religion and i'm standing there today to say it loud and clear that they did not act for god in fact they acted against god they talked about blasphemy let me put it on record. There is no punishment for blasphemy in the Quran. And even some people have become so complacent that they destroy your economy in the southeast. You don't know. You are sitting down at home. It is time to change the leadership by either the leadership resigns for us or we change them by our votes. The demonstration is organized by Catalyst for Peace and Justice in conjunction with Women Advocates Research and Documentation Center, Charlie Boy Foundation, the Committee for Defense of Human Rights, Enough is Enough Nigeria, and Muslim Peace Initiative. I also called on the youths to ensure they vote and create the change that they want. Ivy Kano, TVC News, Lagos.